what's going on crew today we have a 2020 chevy equinox 2.0 liter turbo are you looking to get out in nature well check this thing out this vehicle is complements of alh automotive llc in the lake jackson area of tallahassee how do you find alh look for the lake jackson area tallahassee florida I'll have the information down in the description. We're going to start out here in the front. Nice touches all the way around. When I tell you this thing is well appointed, low miles, all kind of safety features, all kind of tech features in there. Y'all hang tight. We're going to go over the interior and the exterior, and then we'll take it for a spin. I want to see what this 2.0 liter turbo is all about. Y'all hang tight. All right, crew, let's take a look at the exterior on this Equinox. Go around here to the side. Very nice touches all the way around. Got a special touch right here for all my Tallahassee FSU flans. Fans, I thought I'd say flans. So you got this Seminole pinstripe. That's a plus, right? Already on there for you. I love that color. Very flashy, very bright, looks good. What y'all think? Come around here to the side. There's your Equinox badge there. Got these nice wheels from the factory. Michelin tires, of course. Plenty of nice touches on this Equinox. Definitely something to check out. Here is the view from the back. Very nice touches you do have. You actually got a Seminole trailer hitch cover too. Look at that. Bam. Along with dual exhaust ports right there you can see. Nice touches, Carfax One owner. Got what we call the shark fin antenna for the OnStar and the radio stuff. Nice touches, what y'all think? Tallahassee, stand up. There's 27, you just take that down the road just a little bit and you will find ALH Automotive. A little touch that I just saw. You do have what I call the door ding stoppers. So you got these little plastic strips that actually will prevent door dings. Nice touches all the way around, right? Hey crew, let's go ahead and check out this interior of this Equinox. First things first, you can't not notice that infotainment system big screen there very nice touches i'll go more in depth of all these features on the interior when i take it out for our test drive super clean i like the design of the seats of course you have your power adjustments here on the driver's side got these nice 3d mats in here nice touches all the way around got that new car smell can you smell what the rock is cooking smells good to me brand new thirty thousand miles on the clock once again, y'all hang tight. We'll go more in depth when uh, get ready to take it for a spin. See what this two liter turbo is all about. Please inquire for more information. I'll have the information down in the description. All that good stuff. Check it out. Check out the rear passenger compartment here. You got the 60-40 split bench here. You do have cup holders and an armrest right there. You do have charging ports down there. Nice views from back seat. I'm going to hop in there and we're going to see what the uh, leg room test is all about. Y'all hang tight. All right, so we are in here. Look at this leg room back here. Plenty of leg room for your family, for your business, whatever you may use this vehicle for. Once again, check it out at ALH Automotive. Here's the view from the back seat. You've got nice view lines from back here. That screen, can't wait to dig into that and see the features of it. But nice touches all the way around. 
nice ambiance and there's the cargo area we're gonna check that out here in a second y'all hang tight thanks for watching okay, so here we are out back it does have a power lift gate just hit the button right there underneath the Chevy emblem goes up smoothly plenty of cargo area check this out look at that cargo area back there my bag fit perfectly very nice touches and once again you can shut the power lift gate down by just hitting that button and she goes down smoothly. Equinox 2.0T. Y'all hang tight. Just wanted to give y'all a perspective of the view lines and the room back here from the passenger side. Nice touches all the way around. Getting closer to the test drive. Y'all hang tight. And here is the view from the front passenger area. Nice touches all the way around. Once again, the view lines are very nice. That big screen again, which is the highlight of this vehicle. We do have the original window sticker for confirmation of all the features. And it's just a nice truck, what y'all think? Let us know down in the description. All right, crew, so here we are in the interior of this 2020 Chevy Equinox 2.0 liter turbo. First things first, the ambiance in here. This feels good, it feels spacious. Nice view lines out front there. Smallish A pillars, good visibility, good, good size side view mirrors with blind spot monitoring, by the way. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and fire this thing up and uh, take it out for a spin. So first things first, as long as you have the key in your possession, nice key fob, nice weight to it. Typical Chevy key fob, got the Chevy emblem in the back. You got lock and unlock. Uh, remote start you press this button two times you can open up the lift gate and then you got your panic alarm right here so as long as you have this in your possession throw that down in the cup holder in your pocket it is push button start nice touches smooth operation of the engine the gauges do a nice sweep as you can see very well appointed got this nice screen right here as you can see very big very bright it looks like a tablet to me and uh just nice touches all the way around so you have your radio controls in there all those good little options right there. You do have a reverse camera with trajectory. So it's got a nice view back there, very high definition. You come back over here to the driver's center, nice 10 and two grips. You do have some contrast stitching here. You got your headlight controls over here to the left side. You do have navigation. You can enter in an address and all that stuff. How about ALH? Auto motor. Oops, got to spell it right. <laughs> See what it does. But anyway, we're going to go back to everything here. It didn't come up. But anyway, we're here in Tallahassee, Florida. ALH Automotive. You can't miss us. We're right in the Lake Jackson area of Tallahassee, Florida. Nice touches all the way around just put the address in obviously and then uh once again here we go so back to the steering wheel you do have lane departure warning and correction right here you got your cruise control stuff here you have collision alert right here on the left side right side this is for all the uh, menu options here so you do have bluetooth in the screen there here's all the different settings for the vehicle Go back to the left, there's your navigation. So it gives you a little bit of navigation information in the infotainment system as well. You got your radio control right there. You can change your radio stations here on the steering wheel. There's your distance to empty up with your fuel stuff, your average miles to a gallon, and then your home screen, which has your speedometer. This is all customizable, by the way, and your fuel range. So nice touches all the way around. You come over here in the center. You do have dual zone climate control. Nice touches there. You do have front heated seats right here. You can actually sync the uh, air conditioning controls by just pressing that and it'll set the temperature for both sides or switch that off and you got dual zone. So there you go. Uh, down here you have USB charging ports there, auxiliary ports, USB-C port there. You got a regular cigarette lighter, nice little storage area right there. You do have a tow haul mode that you can use in this vehicle. Uh, it doesn't have a dedicated sport mode, but you do have a low range. You have an electronic parking brake right here. You have dual cup holders right here. More storage, as you can see where my phone is. You got a nice size center console here. 
with uh, dual uh, charging ports right there, you do have this window sticker. So let's go through there. All right, safety and security. You got analog brake system, four wheel disc brakes. You have stability track, stability control system with traction control. You do have a tire pressure monitor. You have theft deferrent. We've already showed you the rear vision camera, team driver. You got IntelliBeam headlights, following distance uh, indicator for collision alert, lane keep assist with lane departure warning, automatic emergency braking, front pedestrian braking. You do have 18 inch aluminum wheels on this vehicle. You had to have HID headlamps, daytime running lamps, LED trailer equipment, uh, the interior. You have premium cloth seat trim. You do have a seat adjuster on the driver, eight way power with two way power lumbar. You do have a 60 40 split rear seat. You do have the audio system six speaker. You do have driver information, which is this and that. And let's see what else we got here. Four USB ports, two connected, two charge only. Uh, connectivity and technology. You have OnStar. You do have Sirius XM radio. You'll probably, I'm sure it's probably still running now, but you have to get the membership later on. And then the optional confidence and convenience package, you have a driver convenience package, rear liftgate power assistant, vehicle remote start, uh, the heated seats come in this package, the dual zone climate control comes in this package. You do have a universal home remote, which is up here. You can set your um, garage door openers if you don't want to actually put them on the visors here. You do have a sunglass holder here. You do have uh, visors, lit, lit, uh, lighted visors right there. Let's see what else is in this uh, convenience package. Front fog lamps, lane change alert with side blind zone alert. So that's the um, the uh, blind spot monitoring stuff. You do have a eight inch, let's see, HD color touchscreen, Chevrolet infotainment three plus with navigation and uh the k oh the color i want to give you all the color on this thing i was trying to figure it out it's called cajun red tint coat it looks really really good and then of course the um the pinstripe is already on there so very well equipped nice vehicle what do y'all think it does have auto start stop i see that in there i went on and turned the headlights on and the fault lights on i'm gonna go ahead and put my safety belt on seat belt on and we're gonna go ahead and take it for a ride y'all hang tight see what she's all about first things first like i told you the operation of this uh engine is super smooth you do you can't take it off road if you want to but it's so nice i wouldn't want to mess anything up but here we're going to get out in traffic y'all hang tight and we'll start this review the car review the test drive part i mean all right so we're gonna go ahead and take this thing for a spin Uh, this thing does have a nine speed automatic on it so shouldn't have much issues with gear finding should get you in the right torque band for the optimal optimal boost of this turbo engine feels really good uh low wind noise low road noise this is a very comfortable package equinox have come a long way do a braking test right here so the four-wheel disc brakes feel really really good no nose dive we'll go ahead and do a turn circle test full lock to lock she turns around in the first lane nice touches we're gonna give her a little acceleration test wow this thing pulls wow does she pull <laughs> that was impressive so yeah with the drivetrain the um, the turbo engine plus that nine speed automatic man it really uh give you a little tug so anyway good fuel economy all that good stuff like that right now i'm around close, close to uh 60 mile per hour and the rpms are around 1200 rpm so it's just loafing around should get some good gas mileage for you all and uh, no matter what you use it for, either for personal or for your business, if you do ride share, if you do Uber, if you do uh, DoorDash, whatever, or you're a business owner and you just need something just to travel, 
definitely something to take a look at. And even if you're a family, this will be a great family vehicle. Feels very confident out here on the road. And uh, one thing that inspires confidence is just enjoying what you have. Very smooth powertrain. All right, we're gonna do another brake test here. I'm gonna get down on a little bit harder. And here we go. Feels good, feels safe, feels confident. Do another turn circle test. Give it a little acceleration again. And like I said, with e without a dedicated sport mode, it still feels really confident. Has, it's very torquey, very punchy. And uh, once again, if you're looking for a nice SUV, come stop by ALH today. We'd love to take you out and let you take a test drive, but enjoy the virtual test drive and we can go from there. Thank you all for watching.